What's going on YouTube? This is yours truly, Dre the Plug, coming at you live with some more technical heat. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button below so y'all can stay up to date every single time I drop new technical heat. But more importantly, I wanna show you guys how to code an ultrasonic sensor, and not just to code it really, to really pinpoint certain areas, certain things that you will want to activate based on the range. So if I wanted something to go off in this little area right here, it'll go off. If I want something to end up going off right here, I could do that. Or if I want something to go off all the way down there at a certain range, it will activate as soon as it get within that range. So I'm gonna kind of show you guys how to make that happen, how to code it, and to really like kill two birds with one stone, I'm gonna actually use music to really show you guys how to code the range. Just a music example, which would be really, really cool. So that way, you know, we don't have nothing too complex. I could just show you guys how to add music to it too. But if you wanna use, who knows, like a voice command, a song, uh, a instrumental, anything along those lines within a certain range. Let's get into the video. Let's get into some more technical heat. And another thing, like I mentioned before, like I made a video of basically how to add music to your Arduino project, or if you want to add it to activate when certain things happen, I made a whole video about this a while ago. So I'm gonna link that down below. It's called the MP3 module. So definitely check out that video if you actually want to create this exact project. Shout out to Bailey for keeping my mind right In them harsh times, a young queen showed me the light So that's the only one around when I live through the hype Them so-called queens switch up when you sitting on night And I'm sitting on blaze, I'm a double-edged sword if you still want to play To where you meant to where one and now we acting a fool So But God knows I ain't perfect, he knows most times that I'm right. Shout out to Bailey for keeping my mind right In them harsh times if I took a shot for every person that let me down, I would probably be knocked out or maybe dead in my room. Okay, y'all, so jumping into the construction process, as you guys can see. Let me just show you guys real quick, real quick. So that's right here, the ultrasonic sensor. As you guys can see, so I was connected. Then coming over here. Then being connected to the MP3 module. Then I have an aux cord that's connected to my speaker. Okay, what's going on YouTube? Let's get into the code so we can have music with our ultrasonic sensor, right? So this is an older code that I made probably like two years ago. It was like an add-on feature for a project I was working on, right? But I'm actually show you guys how y'all can easily just, you know, copy and paste this entire code onto your project and then you will be able to, you know, add three, really four different songs to it if you want, right? So I have one, two three four right so like i said if you really want to learn how to add any music to your project definitely look at the other video i'm gonna link it down below but right now if you just want to instantly just add about one two three or maybe even four songs to a project immediately this is all you have to do so jumping into the very beginning right i'm gonna set my range so i have it to about five centimeters to ten centimeters i want my first song to go on you notice the first song because it's zero zero one right here have my next one around 13 centimeters between 20 centimeters so that's that that range right there same thing zero zero two so you know that's the second one right so now jumping into my third one i have 21 between 26 and i have zero zero three then right here i have 27 between 33 so that's that range right there for zero zero four for my fourth song so now you're probably asking like, how do you go about adding the songs onto it? So that's with the MP3 module. I'm gonna show you guys when I actually show the construction process with everything being connected to the Arduino. But as far as the code, this is pretty much it. That's all you need to know. You don't really have to understand how everything is created to the T. If you really just wanna add a song immediately right now with the ultrasonic sensor. And another thing, right? 
So in order for me to add this whole code to YouTube, they don't let you add the greater than or they don't let you add like the less than. So what I'm gonna do right now, I'm gonna just go in and hit Control F and then my greater than sign. Just change that. Greater than, I'm gonna just hit replace all. Boom, all of them changed. So then same thing for my list and sign, right? Same thing for my list and sign. Replace all again. So boom, now I'm able to add this on YouTube and put it down in the description. So if you guys wanna go in and change this and actually have it to where it's the opposite, where everything is actually, you know, the greater than the list and signs are there, all you have to do is the complete opposite. Put this at the top, put this sign at the bottom, and then hit replace all, and then the code will work perfectly. And if you don't do that, the parentheses with the less than sign or greater than sign, it won't run the code. So that's just a little tip for you guys. Okay, so before we start this demonstration, I'm gonna show you guys how to add the MP3s to the serial MP3 player. So yeah, once you get your SD card, right, you're gonna have to format it a specific way first. But besides that, like I mentioned before, you can go back and look at my other video, basically how to format it and all that good stuff. But more importantly, you need to change whatever MP3 files, specifically to the first one being 001, the second one being 002, the third one being 003, and the fourth one being 004 for this specific example. And in the future, if you want to add even more, you'll do the same pattern, 005, 006, if you want five and six and so on. Okay, so this is an older video that I made basically about the serial MP3 player. We'll actually go in and break down the whole process of it and even how to format the SD card. Like it's a way that you'll have to go in and do this. These are like all the steps that I have listed out. But yeah, you may or may not have to do this, but if you get stuck doing this, you won't be able to basically see the files like it won't be compatible with the serial mp3 player if you don't do this so it has to be in this format in order for the arduino and the serial mp3 player to be compatible with one another all right so next we're going to put our sd card into our laptop and as you guys can see that same format appears right so you have to rename your mp3 files to this specific format for example 1 and then the last one 004 for the fourth one so it have to be in this format right so you can use this for mp3 files any song files any voice command files any instrumental long as the mp3 file this is the format that you have to do in order for it to be compatible with the code once you have your songs that you want to add to it, click the SD card down into the serial MP3 player. Just like so. As you guys can see, everything is working because of the green light. If I want to take it out, I just push it down, come right up. That's pretty much it. And now we're going to turn on our speaker. Okay, so jumping into the example, right? Looking at the code, let's zoom let's zoom in real quick all right so right there y'all can see zero zero four and then above that is between 27 centimeters and 33 right so zooming back out as you guys can see got 30 centimeters i'm gonna use this blue box right here to kind of control it for you guys so to where you meant to wait one and now we acting a fool if you came across some money you would start acting new I just came up on this power they don't know what to do i've been getting even better every time i see joe can't believe in petty games and i don't know what's the truth i can't okay so jumping into zero zero three as you guys can see right there we have between 21 and 26 centimeters well, let's get into it zooming back out use my box as the Bluetooth example connected so but god knows i ain't perfect he knows most times that i'm lost he told me that my best art is product of all my flaws i'm steady in a box and began to love all these walls and devastation came from the fact i wanted it out 
All right, so zooming into the second one, as you guys can see, 002, if you have between 13 and 20 centimeters. Let me show you all what I'm talking about. All right, we got the ruler. Let's see, 13 and 20. All right. Shout out to Bailey for keeping my mind right In them harsh times, a young queen showed me the light So that's the only one around when I live through the hype Them so-called queens switch up when you sitting on night And I'm sitting on blaze, I'm a double-edged all right, so jumping into the last one, which is zero, zero, 001, which is the super, super close one, which is 5 centimeters all the way to 10 centimeters, which is our first one, which is extremely close. Let's get it. Let's get it. If I take a shot for every person that let me down, I will probably be knocked out or maybe dead in my room. And that concludes this video. Don't forget to comment like and subscribe it really do help my channel when it comes down to the youtube algorithm if you guys have any questions regarding anything just hit me up on instagram hit me up on the ground at dre the plug one two three and then also go check out my other youtube channel this is actually my second channel my first one was called andre classic cuts i basically go in and give tutorials about all types of different haircuts i actually show people how to do different type of things with the clippers that has never been done and i pretty much go into detail as on why certain things happen so definitely go check out that channel besides that be on the lookout for my next content that's dropping be on the lookout for it because it's coming real soon and i'm out <laughs>